Hello, this is Timothy Perfect from Two Canoes Software, and I want to talk to you today about using the uh, the syncing feature of MDS3 to allow you to easily share workflows and resources. I'll go ahead and open up MDS, and you can see that um, I have a workflow created called Catalina Plus Packages and Rules and Jamf and, and does some scripts. Um, and I have all the workflow options set up. So in this scripts, or in inside the workflow, you can see the Mac OS is installed, uh, resources are installed, all the different options. I even create a user account. And I wanna share this out to some remote technicians. So they'll be able to use this same workflow to create their own workflows. So the way to do this is, the first thing I'll do is I'll do a, a save master for syncing. And um, I'll save that to my desk call top and I'll call this MDS master. Um, and what that does, it creates a disk image and collects up all the resources and the workflow and saves them off to that master disk image. And that master disk image can then be uploaded to a web server and the technicians that are in remote, remote locations can just put in the URL to that disk image inside of their own copy of MTS and it will synchronize all those resources down and allow them to use workflows um, as a basis, those master workflows as a basis for their uh, their own workflows. It doesn't allow them to change the master workflows, but they can duplicate the workflows and use those same resources to be able to do it. So it allows you to keep kind of a uh, approved uh, master uh, of workflows and resources, and then they can base theirs off of it. And of course, they, if they wanted to share theirs, they could as well by just getting a master and, and putting it up on a web server. Okay, it's now done creating this, and so I'll take this MDS master and I will move it to a web server. I currently have a web server shared on this machine, but it could be any anywhere web server that you would want. All right, so now I've got this web server set up and I've copied this one called mdsmaster.sparse image. So I'll just copy that link and you can see that link goes to that image. And now I will go to a, uh, another machine that, has, uh, that doesn't have this workflow. And what I would do is very simple. Under uh, syncing, I would go to add new and add in a name, which would be MDS master. And I would just put in the URL. And what that does is now uh, adds in that information. And then it will synchronize that information down when I click on sync now. And so, um, and it'll make those workflows appear and all the resources will be available and it'll be, all the resources will be available in this folder. Um, so it's a great way to be able to have multiple masters or a single master to be able to synchronize these resources to a remote, uh, from a, a remote master, as well as be able to save those resources. Um, thanks very much for watching. Please make sure to click on subscribe so you get notified of more of these videos. Also click on like because it makes me happy. Um, as well as please check to our um, product page at twocanoes.com slash MDS for the most up-to-date information on MDS. So thanks very much for watching, and I'll see you soon.